From the Tennessee Valley Weather Channel, this is your evening update. Plenty of sunshine again on this Friday across the Tennessee Valley, but clouds are knocking on the door and those will be moving in later tonight ahead of rain shower chances coming for a Saturday. We started at 27 this morning here at the studio in Lawrenceburg, got up to 62 this afternoon. No rainfall, but I do think we have at least a chance of some minor rainfall as we head into our Saturday and Sunday, probably less than a quarter of an inch for most of us across our part of the Tennessee Valley. Mostly clear skies as we head through our Friday evening. That's allowing temperatures already to drop into the 40s. I think it's mid to upper 30s over southern middle Tennessee before clouds increase as we head through the late overnight. That's going to put a stop to the rapid cooling. And if anything, temperatures may actually start to increase a little bit after midnight, especially after 3, 4, 5 a.m. as the clouds really increase as we have more of a southerly wind as well kicking up with that. Both of those things counteract radiational cooling and keep the lower atmosphere mixed. So you may actually see temperatures climb after 4 a.m. so that we're starting in the upper 30s, lower 40s. So there's going to be a range tonight like there always is. I think morning lows are somewhere between the mid 30s to the lower 40s, depending on where you are. And then as we head through our Saturday, a few breaks of sunshine here in and amongst the clouds. If we see as much sunshine as what Futurecast is showing, I do think we probably will hit the lower 60s. However, I'm not sold on that happening. So I'm going more toward mid to upper 50s. However, I am saying that 60s are possible with a little more sun tomorrow afternoon. The showers moving into the area tomorrow afternoon, tomorrow evening. Those continue off and on tomorrow night and through the first half of Sunday. No widespread heavy rainfall. All that's well off to the southeast. Just some passing showers at times. Clearing skies with times we head into our Monday here. But with the big low pressure off to the northeast and high pressure into the plains, we'll have a tight pressure gradient Monday. That means that gusty winds here may be gusting as 20 to 30 miles per hour at times. It's going to bring the wind chill down because we're talking about daytime high temperatures, air temperatures into the mid to upper 40s. So it's going to feel several degrees cooler than that even during the daytime hours. And with sunshine, you see some flying snow flurries in eastern Kentucky, the mountains of eastern Tennessee. But all that activity will stay off to north and off to the north and east of our part of the Tennessee Valley. And the clouds increasing a little bit as we head toward Tuesday night and Wednesday, but no rain with that. And these clouds probably overdone as we've seen several times this week also. So upper 50s, if not lower 60s and spots across the area for Saturday, still hanging in the 50s Sunday. And then behind the front, we're into the 40s for a few days, maybe lower 40s for daytime highs with sunshine on Tuesday after morning lows in the lower 20s and then moderating back to the low and eventually middle 50s as we into the second half of next week. So your hour by hour forecast for tonight, dropping into the 40s this evening, but then you see the clouds increasing after midnight. So notice that the drop in temperature slows down so that we're only mainly dropping into the upper 30s and lower 40s. However, a few folks in Southern Middle Tennessee could briefly sneak into the mid 30s before 2 a.m. or so in, th in between the evening and 2 a.m. before we bump back to the upper 30s and lower 40s. But I think most all of us above freezing tonight. Clouds increasing in a big way for Saturday. Showers here scattered around for the afternoon. Daytime highs mainly in the mid to upper 50s. However, if there is a little sunshine, it could be as high as 60 or 61 across the area. More the same in northwest Alabama, mainly upper 50s with mostly cloudy skies and showers by midday and afternoon. However, again, if there are a few breaks of sunshine here and there, it very well could be the lower 60s. Here's your seven day forecast. Rain showers off and on at times for a Saturday, Saturday night, ending on Sunday, clearing from Monday, but gusty north winds of 20 to 30 miles per hour and cooler temperatures behind that front, only into the lower 40s for daytime highs on our Tuesday here. And that may be a struggle for some people with that cold air mass in place, but we do moderate temperatures going Wednesday through Friday before a chance of more rain showers coming toward the end of next week, Friday night into next weekend. There's Luke's latest seven-day forecast. I'll be back at 9 o'clock with another check of your local weather.